You've been tossed and beaten up. You've fallen again. And I know your heart's been torn. And you say there's no point in carrying on. The race is not over. No, 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 no. It's not over now. To be looked upon like the scum of society. Yet they pour the rain to the strength of your pain. To be weighed by events or accomplishments. Be found lacking when it's to your gain. To be forgotten like the wind of yesterday. Neglected. And beaten and worn The pain that you're feeling is Just as real As the breath you take with this song It's not over But it's not over now This is not You've been tossed and beaten up. You've fallen again. And I know your heart's been torn. And you say there's no point in carrying on the race. Is not over. No, 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 no. It's not over now. You see, after the live year, there's going to be a lot of opinions. And a lot of. Everybody have something to say, but this is my. This is my time. God, give me strength. Give me strength. I will never find happiness and peace in this world until I turn my life over fully God, I will never find peace and happiness until I turn my life over back to God. I had a conversation with this man, the manager. I had a conversation with this manager when me I go through my problem them in a business in a this business with them. I'm a set to the man plus Kara was on the phone. Kara, who is my road manager at the moment, she was on the phone and I've been dealing with a lot. And I said to the man, you see, all of them are problem I want me to feel right now. I said to him, say, no, but I feel say me I go through this. I may feel no way because guess what? All I want me a face now, it have moved me closer to God. Me say, oh no, face say the problem them want me a face. Me feel no way about it. Me say, me no feel no way because guess what, no man? Me have a calling for my life. Me have a calling for my life and God a knock for my door and me need the answer. Me never did the answer and I say to myself, say, <laughs> I will never, nothing can bring me back.
I don't have money problem. Mind you, I go and show no everything I no need for know. <laughs> to know. Because you see, you see, you see, you see what I have near my mental health. You see my mental health and my spirituality. That alone matter to me. Me no business about money. This world no this world no deserve me. And the Bible says, what does it profit a man to gain the world and lose his soul? You see this manager named Richie Flores. In my situation, he represents the devil himself. You see, the money, it represents the objects of the world where my soul I try for wall and pan. You see, my situation, it represents the choice where God has given me now for choose where me go from here. You see, everything what happen, my worries is that if I stop now, how me I go find my food later? How me I go reach us? So? How me I go get this? How my bills I go pay? But you know what the voice said to me? God is your provider, Shanil. Have faith in the Lord because, hmm, God. God is your provider. God is your provider. God is your provider. God is your provider. Why you worry when you can't pray? You see me? May God bless. May God bless. May God bless. You hear me tell you no? You see me? My God bless. My God bless. I'm a faith. I have never lost faith. I have never lost faith in God. I never lose faith in a God ever. No matter how I sin before him. No matter how I sin. My God is forgiving. And no matter what I do in my eyes. He's forgiving. And as long as I have life. He has made it possible for me to come before him and ask him for forgiveness and change my life. And I'm not going to make the situation now. I'm not going to make because of what's happening now. I'm going to make the wrong choice. Mm -hmm. Now I'm going to make the wrong choice. I'm not going to make the wrong choice. But decide for share this with you. I decide for share this with you because. I have always been transparent. Always. Always been transparent and I'll be real to my fans and everybody who supported me. Everybody who has ever supported Chanel, I am very grateful. But on this day, I can't live a life of sin no more. Not solely like that. I can't, I can't have one foot in and one foot out. Because what, you guess what now, you when God bless me, you know, bless me half a blessing. Mr. Richard Flores, I forgive you. I may thank you. Mr. Richard Flores, Richie Flores from Rebel Ace Music, I forgive you. Me, Chanel, I forgive you. I may thank you. You know, I may thank you. When my prayer me ask God for carry me closer to you. Me say, God, bring me closer to you. And in the depths of my situation, me can't see where He has used you, allowed you to do what you have done. And bring me closer to him. <clears throat> I'm showing you everything now. Mr. Richard Flores, Richie Flores, Rebel Ace Music. 
he's been managing me without a contract, of course, for the past, from December of last year. Right? I opened an LLC and I opened a business account. When I opened those, I asked him to run me, to run me, um, the money through the account. So whenever I, I have a legit business now, you can use this as a means. To, this is where I collect all my payment. <laughs> I was so tied up into work, meaning that I was just working, 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 doing shows, doing shows, doing shows, doing shows. I am paying, or the agreement was I would pay Richie 20% for his management consult. And he said to me, I will find, you're, you're going to need a booking agent. I could find a booking agent for you. And he said that I'll try to talk to him to see if he will do 5%, but I, they usually charge 10%. So I'll ask you, I'll ask them if they would. When he came back to me, he said, they'll, they'll charge you 10%. So that's 20% for him and 10% for my bookings. So that's 30% of the perf whatever performance fee a promoter would pay, right? I started doing bookings. I'm going to get so lost in the work, so lost in creating music, so lost in, in just performing and, you know, doing all of that. When I catch up on everything, I've been working since November of last, um, December of last year. I'm going to not stop work. If you know, if you been, I watch me, watch me show and everything. I've been out do music. I've been out do show like nonstop. No back to back every weekend, everything. You understand? And I said to him multiple times, I said, hey, <clears throat> I used the booking agent I, that used to work for me. He was messing up a lot of stuff. Like I would simply just ask, you know, for, um, uh, f in the first class flight, whatever is asked for the promoters, I would have a first class flight and I'll just ask for a window seat because enough time when we leave the show, them are going to the shows. I'm very tired. Most times, if it's not Jojo or anybody else, I pay to do my. I'm here for myself. Okay. I do me hear for myself and stuff like that. You understand? Me, I ended up firing the, 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 the booking agent that he brought on because he was not doing, you know, he was not working up to my expectations. Even after I asked him to fire the person, he didn't in the immediate effect. You understand? So first of all, I've been giving clear instructions on certain things, but they're not being carried out. So... I somewhat don't have the control that I thought I had. Secondly, no. It reached up to the part where I asked to, them to stop tech bookings, right? And I said, stop tech bookings, please. I need a break. Ask them to stop tech bookings. I need a break. I need to, I need to step back. I'm going to need to figure stuff out. My team was not 100%. It's not solid, so it's hard to put everything in when we need for the that you understand i say it i'm gonna say it multiple times i'm gonna say listen i'm not doing any shows in september i need to step back and and figure some stuff out and i need a break the last show i did in september was the third or fourth of september i think within that time i was able to sit and go over my finances i have a business account where and when I start over the finances, I realize, okay, in this business account, I am not able to differentiate or reflect where I have a payroll system. Meaning, say, if they say I make $10,000 for your show, $10,000 is not going through my account. Because the manager, he accepts the $10,000 in his account and then pays me 70% of that. 
Remember, you know, the promoter, them are pay Chanel 10 grand for your show. Just saying. Just saying a figure. Right? But I don't, 10 grand now go through my account. 10 grand now pass through my account. Me only I reflect, say, $7,000. Right? Because 20% of that is $2,000. 10% which goes to bookings is a thousand dollars. So me would I get seven thousand dollars? We're in seven would I come out, hair of a come out of that, makeup, clothing, everything. So I have to take care of my own expenses, of which I don't get paid till after the show is complete. So my money that I already have is what I would use to take care of my expenses beforehand, and I pay my own DJ. Well, that said, when me I go over the whole thing, me realize that, okay, when me for do my taxes, I won't be able to show where I'm paying anybody anything. So I said to my manager, I said, can you do me a favor? Because I have shows that are outstanding that have not yet been completed. I have not. These shows are in the future and i'm going to name them <laughs> so on the candle on the same page on my depends so on understand what i say there's a show i have a show which i missed the, i had i missed the other one yesterday and there was one today for hartford mm, god Let me give me a second. God, give me the strength. 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 Oh, God. I have a few shows coming up of which was included of yesterday and today and a few other shows up till the 23rd of February. Said to Richard, say, Richie Flores, Rebel Ace Music. I said to him, Richie, in order for me to properly situate my finances and my business account and my taxes, I have to do taxes quarterly right i said to i said to richie can you do me a favor please forward the full balance of my deposits that are in your account to my business account and when the shows are fulfilled i will go ahead and oblige to my financial obligations which would mean say i will pay you what is yours and i will pay whoever needs supposed to get their money their money zine And I also sent that in a text message. Let me show another the text message. All right, this is a text message. So this is a text message. I said, hey, Richie, you're probably asleep, but wanted to discuss deposits and where they should go regarding my account. With the graph we have, it shows that my business makes X amount for the year, but regarding my actual finances, it shows only a percentage which complicates my taxes and other financial obligations. Can you please forward deposits to business account? I'm sorting account and payroll and I would need to be, that would need to be done, please. And going further, call when you can. Also, when you can, please send me a summary report.
And I said, no problem. He said, no problem. I suggest we do a call on Monday to go through the spreadsheet and graphs that there is more transparency and clarity as well.